Have you have you eaten? Regina? Gina! Oh. Uh -uh, no. I know it's been about a month you broke up with your ex, but you can't just sit like this and be thinking all day. I'm not thinking, Serena. Not. Well, it's a good thing you decided to relocate. I know new environment helps you heal faster and you can move on. Okay? It's, it's not easy, Serena. It's not. Giving a man four years of your life. And now, this. Like, I, I'm starting all over. I know. I, I understand. It's hard to watch your four years relationship move on with someone else and you're only finding out three weeks to their wedding. I mean, this guy is the definition of the devil himself. But I know you, babe. You're a strong woman. You will get through this. Okay? I hope so. Okay. It's time for you to stand up, get something to eat. Because mm -hmm. I need you to go on a job hunt. Babe, you need to get your life back. Sure, of course. I, I will. Yeah. Alright. Ah, so, I have uh, a client I need to show an apartment quickly. But there's food in the kitchen. You can just help yourself. Okay. Finally, there's a smile. <laughs> Thanks, All right, darling. Don't miss me too much. Okay. Bye. Have a good one. Thank you. Okay. Final touches. <laughs> Sorry, now I'm good. All right. You've brushed this hair like 100 times already. I can't help it. I'm just glad you've decided to take your life back. Hmm. Okay. Here you go. Thank you. You look amazing, I must say. I'm sorry now. So can I go now? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> <laughs> I wish you good luck. Thank you. Bye. 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 seems like all the vacancies in town has been filled up. Like everybody has taken all the jobs available. Somebody even let me inside. They stopped me at the gate. It was that horrible. I understand. See, Regina, these things are not easy anywhere. Okay, but we just have to keep trying. I'm sure something will click very soon. Oh, so you know, I am tired. My, like, my body is knackered, my feet hurt, my back hurts, the sun, all of it. I can't survive another day like this in this town. What? No, don't, don't say oh that. My God. I, I went through worse. My back hurts, my feet hurts. Hey, wait. Oh. 
I understand. But you're not allowed to give up yet. I'm not giving up. I am just resting. Okay, that's good to hear. Yeah. <laughs> Serena, it's been a long day. Okay, I'll just go and fix you something to eat. Just try and get a shower, okay? I will, thank you. And welcome to La Goose. Good uh, sir. Mr. Richard. Regina, yes. look at you. Where have you been? I moved out of town for a while, but I'm back now. Ooh. So, what are you doing here? I've been trying to get a job. It's been difficult, but I'm still on it. Are you still in the business? Sure. Yes, sir. I, I am. I am. Okay. Come by the office tomorrow. Thank you, sir. I will. I will, sure. It was right. nice meeting you again. Have a nice day. You too, sir. <laughs> I don't know. I really don't know. What do you mean you don't know? This is what you've been looking for. A job. The thing is, he's an old friend, and the last relationship with him, it did not end well, Serena. It was bad. That was in the past now. What are you saying? This man is ready to give you an opportunity. See, if you ask me, I'll say you should take it. Uh-huh. You think I should? Girl, I know you should. Yes, now. Okay, 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 okay. I will. Mm -hmm. Shall be ready to buy me my two favorite perfumes when you get your salary. Okay? It's going to be more of a commission thing. That's why you make the big bucks, commission. Mm -hmm. Well. Whichever one, I'll definitely sort you out. Don't worry. Thank I got you. you. I just your commission. Do you think it will be heavy? How much is this? It commission? will be heavy. Okay, girl. Yeah. There is this new clothing line floated about two years ago. They are currently searching for more designers and models. Okay, sir. Do you think you can be that model and do this job? Of, of course, sir, yes. I, I, I can. I, I love to model. You know anything fashion, it's, it's my thing. Yes, sir, I, I, I would. Yes, Call him. I have booked a session for both of you for tomorrow, 12 p.m. Really? Oh my God. He's to take your measurement. No, no, call him, call him. He's expecting you. Oh my God, sir. Thank you. I, I'll call him. I, I will. I will. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you. Oh my god, thank you. I, I'm so excited. I'm, I'm going to call him straight away. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you. I told you taking this job was a fantastic idea. See how it turned out to be easy. You think it's easy? Well, what's better than this? Getting to sample new clothes, taking amazing photographs, plus good pay and stress-free job. Wait, you think modeling job is a stress-free job? You have no idea. Well, either ways, I'm happy for you. They are beautiful. Thank you. I did some sketches when I got back today. Mm. I can't believe I am walking again. <laughs> Feels I'm so good. I'm excited too, I know. <laughs> Well, I just have to step out. 
Please do not forget to call the tailor. I would. I'll call him in the morning, probably. Okay. Um. All right. Take care of yourself. Bye bye. And don't wait up for me. I have my keys. Okay. Have a nice one. her for me okay do anything you can just to make sure she's in good shape till i get there i am going to be there as soon as possible please nothing should happen to her i'm going to be there yes oh well, what's God. going on my aunt my aunt is sick and she needs me by her side but you said she has a daughter she stays with her daughter yes yeah, she does but this woman single-handedly raised me after i lost my mom if she wants me by her side i have to be by her side I have to go and see her. I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't leave her by herself. So you mean you're traveling today? What about the job? I Remember have you to. have a meeting by 12 p.m. Oh God, what do I do? I can't leave my auntie by herself. Wait, I have to go see her. Hello, hello, sir. My, my, my name is Regina. I'm the model. Yes, I was told about you. Sir, please, um, I have an emergency that needs my attention. I have to go there. Please, can I come earlier than we scheduled? C can I come for 10 instead of 12? Please, it's, it's important. What? No. I don't open till 12. I can't do 10 a.m. Sir, please, this is very serious. And it needs my attention. I need to be there. Please, l let me come earlier. I'm sorry, but this is also a serious business. And I don't know what to do regarding that. I start work at 12 and that cannot be changed thanks for calling uh he didn't agree right what do i do Good day. I got your text, so I rushed here immediately. Thank you so much for this, and especially for the fact that the measurement was supposed to be in your office, but you asked me here instead. Thank you. Please, come in. So I um, I did some sketches and I didn't know if you were going to like them, but I thought it wise to bring it along so you could okay. check them out. Let me see. You drew these? Yes, I did. They're beautiful. Thank you. <laughs> okay. Great. Um, let me take your measurement. Okay. Yeah. One second. Thank you. 
right. Uh, shall we? Okay. <clears throat> Sorry, could you turn around for me? to be okay of course i will i'm just going home to take care of things and be with them for a while i'll be back here as soon as everything settles down all right just don't forget to tell me when you get there of course i will i won't forget <laughs> left for me it won't go second. i will i have to see my auntie come on <laughs> all right i'll be back before you know it please it is to pack the that brown shrimp bag the one i do yes 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 everything are you sure all of this? If there's corn and pay, please buy a book for you back. Sorry now. This one that I always could do. I hope you're coming back soon. Of course. Before you know it, I'll be here. Mm -hmm. This measurement. Who's right? <sighs> Regina, hi. Hi, Ken. Um I can't seem to find the measurement I took. I think I misplaced it when I was cleaning my house. So, can you please come in for another measurement, please? I told you I had an emergency, so I'm on my way back home to attend to it. Can you wait till I get back? <sighs> How long would that be? Let's say three days. As soon as I sort everything out, I'll be back. Fine. Okay, that's fine. Thank you. I can't believe this. <sighs> so I was thinking we do like a slit on the side. Okay. Right here, like a really long, long slit. Sleep. Yeah. And um, the neck, a V neck. You know, the fabric is really, really colorful. So I'm mm -hmm. thinking something that really sits well on the model, like mm. brings everything out. But wouldn't it be too much, a V neck with a slit? Mm -mm. No, I think a V neck is great because um, you need to give them like a bit of sexiness. Okay. Yeah. That's right. Yeah, so. so the v-neck and um, mm -hmm. the slit on the side. Then the sleeve should it be like really Oh my god. It's raining. Yes. It oh is. god, I'm hungry. I think we wanted to do this, then go get something to eat. Um, I can fix you something to eat real quick. <laughs> oh wait, um, what exactly can you fix? Noodles and water. I mean, that's what men can fix. That's the only thing they can fix. Wow. Ouch. <laughs> you really don't rate men, do you? Okay, I'm sorry, I forgot to add tea. <laughs> huh. For your information, 
the best chefs in the world are men. Oh wow! Mm -hmm. Really? Yes, really. Okay. <laughs> okay. 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 And I'm going to surprise you. Wow! And I love surprises. Okay. So do surprise me. I will I'm, surprise I'm up you. for it. Bring it on. Okay. I am up for it. Prove Just me wrong. relax. Okay. Uh, Prove me wrong. Enjoy yourself. <laughs> Wow, I make you the I, best food oh, in the world. I love surprises. Bring it on. <laughs> Honestly, I thought this would come out horrible. Did it? No. It's actually very good and I'm, I'm surprised. <laughs> so, where did you learn how to sketch like that? Well, um, for me, it's more like Talent, then practice. Mm. I've always had this flair for clothes and modeling. Isn't that why you're a tilo? It's more like the love of fabrics for me. The thrill of throwing in pieces of fabrics together to form a beautiful thing. It's, oh. it's amazing to watch and I love it. I mean, what's more beautiful than doing something you love so much and fetches you money at the same time? <laughs> I know, right? And you're damn good at what you do. You've not seen me model. But I've seen you sketch. That's, that's true. <laughs> <laughs> So, uh, what do you think about this one? You think this would go? For that? Yeah. Yes. Mm. yes. Yeah. I, it would. It would. It's, it's really colorful and it will sit well on me with mm. that style. Mm. I. It will sit well on me. It should work. Right. Yeah. Okay. Uh, put so a bit what? Of, oh, see. What do you think about this one? Uh uh uh. Mm -mm. We'll go with the first one. No. Yeah. <laughs> this, this will work. The first uh, one will really look good of me, like it was accentuate my curves. Why not? I mean. No, I prefer the first one. Let's work with the first one. <laughs> I'll pass on this. Okay, but why the change of heart? I I changed my mind. But you sketched it. <laughs> I know, but. I just, I checked my mind. I prefer the first one. I mean, it will give us what we're looking for. The fabric, the look, the texture, the feet. Very important. Mm. Yeah. And it's colorful too. You're really pretty, you know that? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Let me look for more options. The first um, one still works better. Yeah, the, there's this particular design. That I, I have something in mind to show you. It, um... So I never go to ask. How about the issue you rushed on for? It's been resolved. My aunt was ill, so I had to go spend some days with her till she got better. Mm -hmm. But she's okay now. Okay. Yeah. Parent? I lost my mom when I was barely eight years old. <sighs> and my dad died seven months later. He couldn't cope. He was so heartbroken. Well, I had to stay with my aunt. She brought me up. 
I'm sorry about that. I didn't know. It's okay. I mean, it's been years and I've learned to live without them. I'm used to it. I'm good. It's fine. It's been years. So, what about you? Your parents? Do you want more food? King. I'm sorry, but can we not talk about it, please? Why can't we? I just told you about my parents. Yeah, but I'm not ready to talk about it. Okay. It's it's nothing, it's, it's just the Can we please not talk about this? King. Um, I'll be in the room. Ken, there's, there's no problem in telling me what I, it's just a simple question. I'm really sorry about earlier. I had no idea it was a sensitive topic for you. I'm fine, really. It's all good. No, you're not. I can see the hurt in your eyes. That means I must have crossed the line and I'm truly sorry. There are some things I just don't like to be reminded of but it doesn't mean he has anything to do with you, okay? It's okay. Okay, I'm sorry for reacting like that. It's okay, it's okay. I totally understand. Just this. Just call back later. Mm -hmm. It's him, right? The tailor. You're beginning to fall for him. Oh, you confess. Don't be ridiculous, Serena. Fall for who? How? I'm ridiculous. Okay. Yes. I see the look in your eyes. And I see how you just want to rush, go over to his place every time. Huh? I go over there because I'm working. We're working together. As far as I know, you work as a model and you don't have any business going to your tailor's place all the time. He is designing my sketches, my idea, my drawings, all of it. So I have to be right beside him too. Okay, okay, yes, you're right. I'm okay. beginning to fall for him. Yes! I said it! I said it. Girl, you know I said it. She's in love. Hey everybody, Jesus. she's in love. Oh, oh stop. What's wrong with Oh my with goodness. You? Okay, so when are we stop. going to hear the wedding I, I, I just said I was falling for him. I didn't say we're getting married when or are we planning to. When cards? Serena, can you just stop? <laughs> so dramatic, stop. Oh, you have to tell me the details. There have no details yet. I'm just falling. No, you won't I, do I'm that. I'm just you falling. You won't do that. Stop. Okay. <laughs> it's nothing like that. Never sounded so excited about a job like this before. There's something about this one. How is Canada? Don't dare change the subject of me, Ken. Answer me. So who is she? Fine. She's a model. She came to me for fabric design and advert. Mm -hmm. And? And she's not only pretty, 
but talented. And you like her, obviously. Have you asked her out? No, not yet. If you like her that much, I think you should. I'll think about it. Don't for long, though. You already know where your heart is, okay? Yes, boss. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I know, I know. Okay, please sit. Um, I want to show you something I was working on earlier, okay? Okay. Um, I, I want to apologize for spoiling your mood yesterday. Um, I'm really sorry. I hate to see you that way. Hey, it wasn't intentional at all. It's okay. You don't need to apologize. All right? So we're good? We're Gucci. You sure? Absolutely. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So, uh, just give me a sec. Okay. Um, Reg? Is everything okay? Yeah. We've known each other for a while now, and I really, 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 really like you. <laughs> and I was hoping that we could take things to the next level. If that's okay with you. Yeah, yeah, it's it's, it's okay. I, I I would love to. Really? Yeah. <sighs> Come here. <laughs> oh. Okay, we need to celebrate this. Yes, yes. Okay. Um, I'll be right back, okay? Yeah. Hello, hello, sir. Okay, sir. Okay, sir. All right, sir. Okay, okay sir, I, I, I'll, I'll be there. No feedback from you about the modeling job. So how's it going? Um, I'm sorry about that, sir. We already took care of everything. We? Yes, sir. The tailor and I, we took care of everything. We took measurements, sorted fabrics, styles, designs, colors, everything. It's, it's going well and we'll deliver pretty soon. The company's expectant. We cannot keep them waiting. We won't, sir. I promise we'll deliver right on time. Good. Um, sir, I, um, I, I'll be on my way. Okay, sir. Bye. The first one you sent to me was seven five. Okay. So what changed? You know what? I needed to look at all the material. Hey. hey. Yeah. <laughs> James, let me call you back in a minute. Okay. I came bearing gifts. 
Nice. Something for the workaholic. <laughs> there you go. Mm. Thank you. <laughs> mm -hmm. So you told me you were going to the office today. So why are you not there? Yeah, I changed my mind. Oh. I see. Mm -hmm. So, where's the first outfit? You told me it was ready. What? I can't wait to see. Babe, it's meant to be a surprise. Okay, fine. You still show me anyways. Come show no, me. Come no, on. No, no, no. It's meant to be a surprise. Okay, fine. So, where is it? Where is it? I can't wait to see it. I can't wait to touch it. Feel it. Where is, where is it? <sighs> fine. It's upstairs in my room. It's on the bed. Okay? Mm hmm Okay. Come yeah. On, go. Is beautiful. Wow. Oh, my goodness. You are gorgeous. Woo. <laughs> it's beautiful. Mm. You did an amazing job. Oh, no, 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 no. It's it's really the model for me. <laughs> wow. Look, both the fabric and design were made for you. You did an amazing job. Thank you. Thank you for bringing my sketch to life. It's beautiful. I can't believe this is happening. What? This me falling in love again with another woman. Who is she? The woman you loved? You mean aside from my mom? <laughs> Don't do that. Don't do what? You know exactly <laughs> what I mean. <laughs> okay. Um, I used to date this lady called Patricia, I loved her genuinely, and let's just say that life happened and we didn't work. Okay. What do you mean, okay? That won't do. Tell me all. <sighs> she fell in love with my friend, and he promised her heaven and earth, and also promised to take her out of the country. He slept with her dumped her and I decided to cut them off. Oh wow. I'm so sorry about that. It's okay. If it didn't happen, I guess I wouldn't have met you. Just, just don't hurt me. I won't.
take any calls. or anything. Easy. I'm sorry, I, I was busy. Busy? Wait, is that part of the modeling? Come on, I, I had things to attend to, so... Okay. Wait, you spent the night with Ken, didn't you? Because I can swear on my life that you've done something with him. Are the both of you now dating? No, we're not. Really? Okay, yes, we are. <gasps> I said it. I said it that my girl is in love. Yeah. Can you just stop? No, I'm not stopping. Stop Give with me the drama. all the gist. There's no gist. No way. There's this no is the gist. only way you're going to compensate me for keeping me up all night. There's no gist. What do you want to hear? Oh my God, Serena, can you just let me? No, talk? I. There is no gist, tell girl. Me. Nothing. There's but the nothing to in your belly. <laughs> I want to hear details. Yes, mom. I mean. It's been a while and she's been amazing. Hmm. You sound good. She must be a wonderful person. Yes, yeah, she is. Also, I am thinking of taking things to the next level if I can. If you can? Of course you can. If you will, just ask her and see where it goes from there. <sighs> I don't know, Mom. I don't know. Just do it. Your father was never in my league. But I loved him and I married him. What I'm saying is you never know until you try. Ken. I'm here. You alright? I'm fine. Speaking about your father. Mom, please. You know I never want to speak about that man. But he's still your father. You know what? I have to go. I have work to do. Ken. Ken. Oh my god, these pictures are so beautiful. Thank you. Like, you're such a fantastic model. I know, right? <sighs> but I wouldn't have achieved this without the help of Kane. That guy is a wonderful tailor. He's I know. so good at what he does. I know. See, I, I can't contest that, really. My goodness, did you see the magic he came up with from your designs? I swear. <sighs> I, I couldn't even believe it. Now I see why the company decided to give you both more fabrics. It's a win-win for us, too. I totally mm -hmm. agree. <laughs> oh, my God. Um, I love every bit of the pictures. All of it. Yes, I do, too. Um, so, about your... Your sister. Serena. Uh, what? I, I, I need to know. Like, she cut me off. She fled the town. Why is she behaving as if nobody makes mistakes? She wants her life to be the way it is now, private. <sighs> okay. So she's married now and she has moved on from everything, right? Yeah, she's married with two kids now. And she regrets the past. She regrets everything. She's moved on, trying to heal. But she doesn't want to come back here or reconnect with anybody that would remind her of her past mistakes. Even me? Anyone at all. Okay, sadly, I understand. Well, back, oh my God, I can't get over this picture. I love this one, what? really, yeah. Can you see that? Looking up at the night 
light of the sky We see them flying free That's just like you and me Looking up at the night The stars light up the sky We see them flying free That's just like you and me Everyone is lonely sometimes But I will walk a thousand miles To see your face Wherever you are I go home Only let's escape The pain of reality I'm speechless. It's so perfect. Yes. We've done this for months now, but every time... They come out better than before. I know, right? <sighs> I love this, babe. Wow. Hmm. Could you turn around for yeah, me? Yeah, sure. Just, oof, there you go. Mm -hmm. uh -oh. Snatched. <laughs> yes. I love wow. this, babe. Mm -hmm. Patricia was a fool to let you go. You're the best man I've ever met. And I swear I am not lying. Right. Mm -hmm. oh. okay. Oof. Baby, you look amazing. Thanks to you. Oof. My model. Uh-huh. Oof. Mm. Okay. Do that work for me, let me see. Oof. Okay. <laughs> Come on. Babe, I love this. It's beautiful. It's gorgeous. Look at this. Oof. It's perfect. That's good. Mm -hmm. You know what I feel like doing right now? Taking it off? Yeah. <laughs> Do this. And then put it in here. It's my birthday in three days time, and I have no idea what to do with myself. Baby, there are a lot of things we could do, and lots of places we can go to. Okay, so, where and where? It's going to be a surprise. <laughs> it's fine, it's fine. I got a bill from the company, and I loved the pictures, babe, all of it. I swear, like, they loved all of it. Hmm. Yeah. The pictures or the model? Are you jealous? <laughs> Any man would be jealous. As I was saying, they loved the pictures and the model, of course. Right. On a more serious note, they said I was going to hear from Mr. Richards on whatever they decide. And it's looking good because they loved everything, like all of it. They loved what we did, babe. Whatever they decide. And they couldn't tell you that in the mail. Why must you go to Mr. Richard to tell you that? Okay, calm down, babe. <laughs> what, what, what's going on here? Nothing. Just do whatever makes you happy. I don't understand. What's, <laughs> what was this? Have I said something wrong? Nothing. It's not a big deal, okay? After all, he said Mr. Richard got you your job. So just go to him. Kane. What has come over you? That's nothing. Nothing. What did I do? Ugh. Okay, wait, what aren't you telling me? Because all of this, I don't understand it. Kay. Kay? Okay, this, this is not funny anymore. Kay, it's just pictures. They like what we did. Kay, what is going on? What has come over you? I said it's, oh my goodness, I said it's nothing. Okay, wait, you don't want me to have meetings with men when I'm a model? That is ridiculous. I never said that. Then what is it? What is it? Because you get irritated or upset over little things. I don't know what to say or what not to say to you. Babe. Don't babe me. 
You need to talk. Start talking. Because I don't understand these things. I don't understand it. Baby, like I said, it's nothing for you to worry about, okay? It's fine. All right then, fine. What, what, what's going on? I'm leaving. If you don't want to communicate with me, then I have no business being here. I've told you everything you need to know about me. But talking to you is exhausting, Ken. You don't want to tell me anything. Baby, come on, you, you don't have to do that, okay? It's nothing. Okay, fine. If it's nothing, I'm leaving. Babe. Gosh. Babe. Hey. Are you okay? Yeah. It's Ken. Ken, what happened? He just were in, 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 in a conversation and he just fled up and got upset. We, he, did, he couldn't even tell me what I did or said wrong. Why? Is it your work? Shouldn't you have asked him more instead? Why though? Aren't we in a relationship? Is that not the essence of being in, in a relationship to get to know your partner better? How would I get to know him if he doesn't give me the chance? Where are you? I'm still in front of his house. Okay, okay. Um, I'll call you after your meeting, okay? All right, thank you. What is this, sir? Open it. Sir, this is good. This is wonderful. I am so, so glad. What? The company said they recorded a rise of about 85% with the styles both of you cooked up. Oh my God, sir. That this, it's, that is good news and I'm so, so glad to hear that. I'm so happy, I'm excited. So, they want to retain you with a contract for one year and six months. What? Oh my God! Oh my God, sir! I'm so happy! You will be their model and Kane will be their designer. Do you think this is a job you can do? Of course, sir. This is what I know I can do. I can do this. I'm built for this. Oh my God, thank you so much, sir. Thank you for the opportunity. All right. Go and read through the contract outside. Sign it and give it to my secretary. we will get it back to me here. Sure, sir. I, I, I'll, I'll do that right away. Thank you so much, sir. I'm so excited. Regina. Sir. Never mind. Go on, go, go and get the contract done and over with. Okay, sir. Oh my goodness, congratulations! Thanks, babe. Thank you. You know I wouldn't have achieved this too if not for you. You encouraged me to stand up when I was down. It's okay. And that fool that left you, he's going to ever regret that he did that to you. I don't care. I've moved on. I have a wonderful man with me now. Someone whose dreams align with mine. Hmm. Talking about men. How is Ken? Spoken to him yet? No, I've been ignoring his call. Why? I thought you'd look for ways to sort things out with him. I am, but I can't keep trying when the other person just pushes me away. It's frustrating. Girl, maybe he's just going through stuff he's not ready to talk about yet. We are dating for Christ's sake. Who knows if things work in our favor, we might even get married. Is that how we're going to be? I understand how you feel. But I, I think you should just follow him up gradually. Give him time to open up. Seriously, maybe he gets triggered and... And I need to at least know his trigger so I can avoid it. He keeps getting angry at weird things. It's crazy. Okay, okay, hold on. Relax. We're supposed to be celebrating, all right? Let's just get rid of the bad energy and I need you to at least let him know about the news tonight, okay? I'm not going there. I think Mr. Richard will inform him. By the way, he's a designer too for his company and has known him longer than he knows No, me. you're not going to do that. Don't, don't do that. What? If Mr. Richard wanted to tell him, he shouldn't have called you to his office to do it, alright? So, come on. 
I need you to try and talk to him. Fine, I'll call him. No, no, you'll go there and see him and tell him to his face. All right? So sorry about everything. Ken, I don't understand how we'll be in a relationship, but you keep shutting me out. Babe, it's frustrating. I'm not shutting you out. You are. You know that I'm not, babe. Look. As humans, there are certain parts of our lives that we'd like to forget. But it just doesn't happen no matter how hard we try. And we project that fear on others. Babe, hey, I don't want to lose you. Come, babe, don't say that. You will not lose me. I'll be here always, okay? Yeah. And I'm sorry too. I know. I just get really scared sometimes. Hey, it's, and... it's okay. I mean it, really. And I have good news. Really? Yes, yeah, so our contract has been renewed, babe. Are you serious? Yes, babe. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> we need to celebrate. Of course, we will celebrate. So, <laughs> okay. how are we celebrating? Well, uh, are you cooking? What? <laughs> well, so now you want me to cook for you? You want a man to cook for you? I'll, I'll manage whatever. <laughs> okay, ready? So, how did it go? It went well. We talked. We're good. We spoke it out. Okay. That's good. So, what's the plan for tomorrow as the birthday girl? There's no plans, actually. You know, this promotion requires more work, more responsibility. So, I'll just go to work. Wait, so you're telling me he's not planning anything? That, that's weird. It's not. We still have six designs to finish up a model from the old contract. So, I'll just walk. The bed they can wait. Wait, <laughs> is this the same Regina that is always so hyper about her birthday? The same one? <laughs> okay. It's funny how love can make someone change overnight because I don't know who this is. Serena, I didn't change. I just value my job. Okay, keep lying to yourself. Okay, enough about me. Mm -mm. Enough about me. Let's talk about you. So, there's this guy I see you messing around with. You're seeing some guy. What? Yes, you heard me. Tell me who... He, wait, wait. You think I'm blind? You think I don't see you sneaking out, taking those midnight walks? I see all of that. Now, spill. Spill, okay. girl. Yes, I'm all... Yes. Girl, relax. Okay. Uh, uh, I can't. Ugh. Spill, girl, you're not saying anything. Okay, there's this uh -huh. guy. Oh, yes, uh huh. No. Who is don't, he? Don't do Where that. is he? When is the wedding bell <laughs> no, ringing? Uh, you go talk, I'll be no go talk. <laughs> talk, oh! Okay, uh -huh. I'm I'm <laughs> oh, yeah, spill, spill. <laughs> spill, you're on the hot seat now. All right. Your turn. Oh, All right, I'm listening. Fine, okay. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I want to hear everything. Uh -uh. Leave nothing unsaid. Wait, you know they talk, oh. <laughs> You go. Oh my goodness. Girl, what's that? Um, I think it's a gift. Wait, hold on. Today's your birthday. It has to be for you. Let me see. Okay. What does it say? I don't know. Let me see. It's from King. 
Birthdays are big days and I wish to make your big day beautiful lunch at my place. <laughs> oh my god, I knew it. I told you this guy was the one. You didn't say anything like that. Well, we just have to get you something nice. Makeup on fleek, jewelries, 10 over 10 package because heads have to Serena, roll today. No head is rolling today. It's just my birthday in his house. I can't hear Lunch, you. nothing serious. I can't Nobody's hear head is turning. I can't hear Serena, you. it's my birthday, not yours. I don't care. Oh my God, this what girl. Is she? Oh, I can't I wait to right see. Now. Why are you Oh my god, what could be this? Oh, I found a perfect dress for you, girl. Bad oh, day in a bitch. Bad day in a bitch. Let's see what's in here. Serena, don't you think this is too much? The makeup, the dress, hair, everything. It's enough now. I'm just going for in-house lunch. Well, at this point, I don't care about what you think. <laughs> yes. Oh, come on now. This is too much. <sighs> too much? Girl, today is your birthday. I'm just saying. Allow yourself to look good. Okay. Just say so. All right, stand up. Mm. Elegantly. Okay. Mm. Mm. All right, so you look fabulous Thank today. Thank you. Here. Oh. Thanks, Serena. It's okay. What are friends for? <laughs> I can't believe this is happening. Like I have my own man who loves and adores me. I have a job that I love. I love doing my job. It seems like everything is falling into place. Mm -hmm. Luck is on my side. Fibo is smiling down on me. I am happy again, Serena. Yes, you deserve to be. Mm -hmm. Seriously, you deserve all the good things of life. Thank you. Happy birthday once again, love. Thanks, darling. Big hug. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'm so happy. Uh, no tears. Don't spoil my makeup. If you spoil my makeup, me and you have issues. Bye. And let me see you off. Okay. okay. <laughs> this is delicious, babe. Mm. I'm glad you like it. I love it. <laughs> I still can't believe you went all the way out to make lunch for me. Thank you. Of course I did. It's your special day. Babe. We've known each other for a few months and it's been the best month of my life. Same here, babe. Are you sure? Of course I do. Yeah. So, can we do this together every month for the rest of our lives? Do what? Oh my God. Hey, no. Baby. Oh. I love you so much. You make me happy. And I want this happiness to last forever. That's if you say yes, of course. <laughs> I did it already. Right. Oh my God. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Hey, oh my god. Mm. You like? I love it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. It's okay. Oh, babe. Mm. Oh. Mm. I am so sorry. I'll look into it. Yes. I promise I'll check it out myself and I'll get back to you, okay? Yes. Looking up at the night, the 
stars light up the sky We see them flying free That's just like you and me Looking up at the night The stars light up the sky We see them flying free That's just like you and me Everyone is lonely sometimes But I will walk a thousand miles Mr. Richard What are you doing here? Dad? What are you doing here? It is because you're not picking your calls. And if I'm not taking my calls, that means I am busy and you should have waited. You don't talk to your father like that, boy. If you don't want me to speak to you in that manner, then you stop this dad nonsense. Go back to your office. When I'm ready to attend to you, I will. There is an emergency. I don't care what the emergency is. We had a deal. I have a month to deliver the outfit and I still have eight days left. So get out of my house and I'll call you when I'm ready. Where are you going to? There, there, an emergency I, I need to attend to, so I need oh, to... Oh, 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 you just got here. I, I thought we were spending the day together. Yeah, but I um, I changed my mind. I, I need to attend to something. I need to go. Please. Okay, okay. Can you at least tell me what the emergency is? Please, I, I need to go. Hey. We see them flying free, that's just like you and me. Looking up at the night, the stars light up the sky. We see them flying free, that's just like you and me. Everyone is What are you doing here again? I thought I told you not to come back here till I'm ready. Do you have anything to do with the girl I saw earlier in your house? What kind of question is that? Huh? It is important. Mind your business. I am saying this because I have your best interest at heart. If you have anything to do with that girl, discontinue it. Oh, what kind of statement is that? I am advising you as a father would a son. If you have anything with that girl, end it. helped you achieve. How dare you do this to me? How 
How dare you start something up with my son? Christopher, sir, I had no idea he's your son. And I'm deeply sorry. I'm sorry. What is there on your, on your hand? Is, is it a ring? Are you engaged? What the hell is wrong with you people? If you love this job and it's important to you, you must end this relationship. I will not say it again. Leave my office. Sir, I, I, I said end it. I said end it. And leave my office. Now! We need to end this relationship. What's going on? A lot is going on and I need space. I need time to think. I need time to concentrate. I need my peace of mind. I don't understand. First of all, you left my house. You stopped picking my calls and now this? What's happening? I, 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 can't, I can't continue this relationship with you. I, I need to concentrate on work and I need to put more effort into work. And you didn't know that before we started this relationship? I just need peace of mind. I I need time to think. Just I I, I can't do this. I, I need to focus on my work and my peace of mind at this point. Please. <laughs> Dad came to the house, saw Regina, and asked me to call off the relationship. What? Why? I don't know. But the girl broke up with me and has refused to take her calls. Dad is not answering his phone. No one is talking to me. No one is giving me any answers. Calm down, okay? Everything will be alright. There must be something going on that you just have to calm this, down. This thing is frustrating. Why is no one talking to me? Why? Just calm down, okay? We'll sort this all out. I've called off the relationship with Kane. But I believe the best thing and the right thing to do is to go and speak with him. Jim, that boy doesn't want to see me. Especially not with this news. But you need to go and talk to him. He needs to know what happened. 
Whatever he decides to do or say is up to him, he can make his decision, but he deserves to know. I have always known that you hated me because I cheated on your mother who left to Canada and moved on with her life. That is why we don't have a father-son relationship. I don't like you and you know that. I don't like people knowing that someone like you is my father. Years ago, Regina was modeling for me. I knew her through her sister, who was my secretary then. She was a hard working young woman. She brought her sister Regina in. She was a good girl, so I hired her on the spot. Hmm. I started dating my secretary, who was Regina's elder sister. Your mom found out with good evidence that she filed for divorce and left the country. What? Then, the secretary left town with her sister then. Then Regina got back to town months ago. She's a really good girl. And she really, she's really good at what she does. And also, in need of help. So, I decided to employ her once again. Hmm. Look, Ken. If it was a sister, I will not lift a finger. I will never help her. I said to myself, Richard, this girl didn't do you anything wrong. So I decided to let bygones be bygones. But I did not contend with the situation that both of you were going to fall in love. I am so sorry. I mean it from the depth of my heart. I'm sorry. Looking up at the night, the stars light up the sky. We see them flying free, that's just like you and me. Looking up at the night, the stars light up the sky. We see them flying free, that's just like you and me. Everyone is lonely sometimes. I called you to inform you that I've spoken to my son. He knows everything now. It is most unfortunate that things turned out this way. It's okay, so no, no problems at all. So what is your decision on the contract? I'll, I'll keep working. That's the only future I see now. How will you do it now that you two are not together anymore? I'll find a way. Figure it out. That's all right. Okay. I didn't see this coming. I had no idea Mr. Richards was your father. 
If I did, I wouldn't allow my heart to fall so deeply in love with you. I wouldn't allow it. Now, now you know why we can't be together. together. It came crashing down like a pack of cats. Just calm down. Everything is going to be okay. <laughs> Look at me, Serena. I can't even do anything. I can't concentrate. I can't even work. <laughs> I feel so lost. God, I can't believe this is happening to me. I thought, I thought this was it for me. I'm so sorry. Okay, you know what? Today might be dark and painful, but tomorrow will be brighter and it will be everything will be fine. I promise. Just just hang in there, okay? <laughs> talk to you for some days now. You just shut everyone out. Are you okay? I'm fine. So tell me, how do you feel? It's been like three weeks since you guys separated. How has it been for you? We can't be together, Mom. Not after what happened in the past. Her family shattered mine. I can't just imagine myself being in in such a relationship. Look, I already forgave your father. I've moved on. And I'm happily married to another man here in Canada. Please, don't let the pain of yesterday prevent you from seeing the light of tomorrow. Please. Mom. No, listen. What happened has happened. The young lady was even remorseful enough. She came personally to apologize to me before she left town with our younger sister. Mom, you, you don't understand. Dad is... I don't see them as bad people, Ken. Shit happens. If you love this girl, go back to her and please forgive your father. You can't bear such grudge to the grave, okay? Please, I'm begging you, baby. Please. <laughs> For so many years, I've let the pain of my past and the mistakes of my dad dictate my life. I, I was afraid of confronting it and it took you walking out on me to realize that I needed to face my fear. I needed to start afresh. Rich. My life has been a wreck without you in it. All I'm saying is that I want a chance to do forever with you. Please. I'm sorry, 
I didn't fight for our love. I'm sorry I walked out at the slightest threat. Cain, you're a good man. You're an amazing person. So yes, I would do forever with you. Thank you. Thank you so much. And... So... Oh. <laughs> yes, I came right there. There we go again. There we go again. <laughs> no, you did. <laughs> yes, I did. So, I'm going to re-ask you to marry me again. Yes, I will marry you over and over and over again. Yeah, <laughs> that sounds good to me. <laughs> mm. Rich, I love you so, so much. I love you too. Everything okay, sir? As a matter of fact, yes. I don't know how and what you did. But Cain called me this afternoon to apologize about his past attitude. He also told me we are back together again. Yes, sir. We are. Welcome to the family. Thank you, sir. Ah. It's good. I'm glad. Back to business. Oh, right away. I have a connect for both of you. Really? Yeah. Sit down. Really? Sit down. 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 Sit we see them flying free, that's just like you and me. Everyone is lonely sometimes. But I will walk a thousand miles to see your face wherever you are. I go home. Only let's escape the pain of reality. Everyone is lonely sometimes But I will walk a thousand miles to see 